Hello and a warm welcome from the English West Midlands. We find ourselves at Molyneux. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Liverpool. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. The initial 11 for Wolves. Ruben Neves plays alongside Joao Moutinho in central midfield. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Let's take a look at the Liverpool starting 11. Alisson begins in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And now they get the ball rolling. And the referee says play on, advantage Liverpool. And the intention was to let the play flow, but no real advantage forthcoming, and now a free kick. Well, a foul, but no yellow card at this early stage, in the opinion of the referee. Well, he might just be lucky it's so early on. He'll have to be careful now. He's protecting it effectively. And a throw in forthcoming. Oh, lovely incisive pass. And he could cash in. Pivotal moment defensively. Thiago. And this is Diogo Jota now. Jota, well it could be on for him here, oh he saved it! Well excellent from the keeper, that's a really top class save. Well oh, they're going for the short one. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. The outcome is a goal kick here. Well, they've started the game really brightly here, and they've looked dangerous. But that was a top-class save from the keeper. Brilliant from him. Ruben Neves, committed challenge, Thiago, oh could be, oh magnificent from the keeper, fantastic stop. Short corner taken. He made it look simple, really. Roman Saiz. Counter-attacking, very much an option. 
Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Neves. Given away by Wolves. Diogo Jota. It's with Fabinho. Jota. Could be. Well, the post getting in the way there. Well, that was a bit unlucky because you just get the feeling they need to make the most of one of these chances. Ryan Ait Nuri. The inside route looking promising. And a body in the way. Intense pressure. Henderson. Takes the shot. Well, as he hit that one, it looked as though it had a chance. of options Henderson Diogo Jota Jota in it goes the goal for 1-0 and that changes the dynamic Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Back in action then. A wake-up call for Wolves, perhaps. Can they find a response? Martinho. Good width from Wolves. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. And they need to get tighter. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? Favouring the short one. Electing to cross into the centre. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. He takes aim. And the keeper stretching to deny him. Well, the short corner routine. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Well, those stats don't lie. Liverpool haven't controlled the ball, but when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. He has time to play it over. A very good tackle.
Diogo Jota. Oh, it's a wild, wild finish. Ruben Neves. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? Happy to take on the shot. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And the referee has deemed that, and the opportunity was there. Yeah, it's a well-worked corner, and he makes decent contact, just lacking that bit of accuracy. Roman Saiz it's with Moutinho there to win it back over the touchline for a throw in oh, pressing really high good work to win it back high up the pitch and the referee has pointed to the spot penalty given well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. <laughs> to extend the lead here. In it goes! A well-taken penalty! Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. So, the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, we're highlighting him for a reason, Stuart. He's putting in a really authoritative performance here. Well, I think he's been outstanding so far. He's looked a constant threat and he scored a very good goal. What a player he is. So into the second half, and it's not lost on Wolves fans that that effort in the first 45 wasn't good enough. Well, they fare better this time round. That is tackling of the highest order. And he keeps going. And in with a real chance. There it is! The goals keep coming. No stopping them today. Well, just look at how poor the defending is here. But I have to say, it's still a very tidy finish. He looked really assured there. Time for the cross. 
He read the situation defensively and did his job. Milner. James Milner has given it away. And possession given away. Great effort to keep that one in play. Salah. Really good challenge. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Fabinho. Oh, that was a terrific attack, but they'll be disappointed about the way it ended. Well, it's good play. They force the error, break forward quickly and create the opening. However, the finish didn't match the rest of it. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Jimenez Nelson Tomato has it and space to cross it well that's how to break the spirit of the attacker Milner robbed of it Matip Fabinho now Alexander-Arnold giving the ball away Diogo Jota brilliant piece of defending from Joao Martinho Wolves with the ball once more. Just 20 minutes remaining now. He's beaten his man. Good defending in the end and danger averted for now. Fabinho. Being pressed and pressed high. They've got it now, what can they do? No foul play, says the referee. And perhaps a bit fortunate not to be shown the yellow card. Different story next time, no doubt. Substitution for Wolverhampton Wanderers. Coming off the pitch, number nine, Raul Jimenez. To be replaced by number 17, Fabio Silva. Substitution for Liverpool. Coming off the pitch, number 20, Diogo Jota. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Foiling them effectively. And the referee says, play on, advantage Liverpool. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Per block, and borderline offside, but correct. And nearing the end of the game and things look rather bleak from a Wolves point of view well they just never got going people will point fingers towards the center backs and keeper and to be fair they've been poor no doubt about that but they haven't had much protection there's been so much space for their opponents to operate in and they've had a field day the final whistle can't come soon enough oh a vital interception could be a chance to break here well, a good tackle. 
Nelson Semedo. Neves. Foiling his opponent completely. Trying to pick out a teammate. And no way through. A Liverpool free kick coming up. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. And still danger here. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Moutinho Fabio Silva it's with Moutinho Nelson Semedo so the referee brings this match to an end the final whistle is sounded and far from the ideal scoreline from the Wolves point of view it was the nature of the performance more than anything else they never got out of second gear and were completely dominated all over the park tell you what though I wouldn't want to be in that dressing room right now Another more than effective night's work for Mo Salah. Your thoughts on his performance? Well, I have to say that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent.